What's up, super people? My name is Aaron Oster. I am a number one best-selling author on Amazon. And today I'd actually plan on doing a different video, but uh, I think this is actually pretty relevant and it's important that uh, authors know this. And that is how to avoid being scammed as a self-published author. Yes, there are a lot of places out there that are looking to scam you, steal your money, and then dump you like you are a hot garbage. So, um, yeah, I thought I'd talk about that today. <laughs> so if you could uh, just smash that like button, join the Super Mage fam, and uh, <laughs> by that I just mean subscribing. I mean, for the very low price of just tapping that subscribe button, you will make this little boy very happy. I know I'm not a little boy, but I will still be happy if you subscribe. Uh, so with that said, let's get right into the video. So for all of those people, or you awesome people, who clicked on the video to see how to avoid getting scammed, I will tell you exactly how to do that right now. I'm not going to make you wait all the way to the end of the video, but if you stick through it, you'll get more details. So the easiest way to tell if you're being scammed or not is just by asking one question. That's it, just one question. And that is, are they paying you or are you paying them? If someone reaches out to you and says, hey, we can help you put out your book and all you have to do is pay us $1,000. They are scamming you. It's that simple. If someone reaches out to you and says, hey, we love your book, we'll give you $1,000. Chances are, they are not scamming you. Then again, there are always the in-betweens, uh, you know, do your research, obviously, before you go with any publishing company, even if they are offering you an advance, uh, read over the contract, see what they're offering you, make sure you like uh, who you are dealing with specifically, uh, but generally when it comes to these smaller, um, independently owned publishing companies that mostly work through Amazon, uh, they are, for the most part, pretty trustworthy people. Again, there are exceptions, and I have not really dealt with any of them personally, but the ones in my genre anyway, in the game lit, lit RPG genre, they are, for the most part, pretty trustworthy, unless they're looking for a cash grab. So, the reason I decided to do this video is that the other day, I was um, looking through the internet, obviously, and um, I am someone who is constantly looking for new things in the self-publishing area. Um, I'm always looking to learn something new, always looking to improve my knowledge in the self-publishing field. And I was looking through the internet and I came across this company, not gonna name names, and they were claiming that uh, they, you know, this, this company could get people to be bestsellers. You know, we guarantee, they were saying, that we can make your book an Amazon bestseller and, uh, you know, we have this whole course planned and blah, blah, blah. So I'm like, okay, fine, you know what, let me, let me look into this more because whenever I see people making outrageous claims like getting your book to the number one uh, Amazon bestseller status, I'm like, okay, let me take a look and see how legit they are. So after doing my research and reading through this, you know, company's blog and FAQs and all that other stuff, I finally found what I was looking for and that was the testimonials where people were like, oh my gosh, they were the best and they got us to uh, Amazon bestseller status. And after looking through that, I soon discovered that no, they were not getting books to Amazon bestseller statuses, but were rather getting people into number one best-selling categories on Amazon, which if you are publishing with Amazon, you should definitely know the difference between the two. An Amazon best-selling book is a book that reaches number one in the entire Amazon store. That means if your book has a number one best-selling, uh, you know, number one bestseller in the Kindle store tag, you're an Amazon bestseller. If your book has a number one bestseller in um, Bears Children Fiction, you're the bestseller in Bears Children Fiction. Okay, you are not an Amazon bestseller. And that is a very distinct difference. So I was looking and reading some of these testimonials and people were like, oh my gosh, these people helped me out so much. They were amazing. They delivered all their promises. And what these poor authors don't realize 
is that just because you get to number one in a category doesn't mean you're actually making any money. You can be the number one bestseller in frog children's books, but your actual Amazon bestsellers rank is going to be like 150,000 to get into that category. Some categories are very not competitive, which means that even if you get a bestseller tag, you're not actually selling anything. So this is just one of the many examples of companies that will come after you and they will scam naive independent authors into paying them a whole bunch of money and not actually giving them anything for it. And I myself was a victim of this. Yes, believe it or not, I actually got sucked into one of these companies as, an, as a new author. Thankfully, I did some more research and found out that they weren't actually very legit and yeah, they tried to charge me like $1,200 to help me publish my book. Now, again, if there is any publisher out there that is claiming that they can help you publish your book, if you only give them money, run the other way. I'm serious. Do not even consider paying someone else money to publish your book for you. Any publisher who wants to publish your book will pay you, not ask you for money. Now, paying for an editor or a cover artist or uh, proofreaders or anything that has to do in the publishing market to help you get your book out there, that you should pay for. Those are legitimate services that you are going to need. But if anyone claims that they are going to help you publish and all you have to do is give them money, don't do it because they are scamming you. They prey on new authors. These people are literally predators. They prey on new authors. They take money from them and then they don't deliver on those promises. And by then you're already stuck. So again, do not fall for these people. Don't fall for them. If someone wants to publish your book, they'll be paying you money. They, they, and on top of that, they won't just be paying you money, but they'll be covering a lot of the costs Yes, they're going to take a cut of your profits for that, but think about it this way. And this is the way pretty much every publishing company works, is that they are taking all the risk on themselves. They are covering all the upfront costs. They are giving you an advance on your books. And um, they are uh, generally have a much, a much bigger reach than you as an independent and new author will have. So... Again, legitimate publishing company will give you money. Illegitimate publishing company will ask you for money. And a lot of times, they will ask you to sign away your rights too. So don't do that. Um, yeah, so that, that, that is pretty much it. Don't get taken in by these scammers. So uh, with all that said, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you could please just... Hit that thumbs up and <laughs> hit the thumbs up button. Ugh, I don't even know what I'm saying there. Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe. We want to get to a thousand, right? And by we, I mean I. I want to get to a thousand. <laughs> so if you hit that subscribe button, you're going to help me down. Comment down below if you have ever been scammed. And uh, let me know how you were scammed because, again... Um, it's very important to get the video out, get the word out, because I've spoken to people who didn't even know that this was a thing, that these predatory companies prey on these authors that don't know better. So please spread the word, if not for yourself, then for other people, to let them know that just by avoiding, you know, this, this one thing, this one little bit of knowledge, they can avoid uh, getting scammed out of potentially thousands of dollars. So again... Please subscribe, hit that thumbs up button, comment down below if you have ever been scammed or if this um, knowledge is helpful to you. Also, uh, another thing, if you um, don't have an Audible account, you can sign up for Audible uh, using one of my links down below and you can get a free audiobook. And here I am checking <laughs> to see if I've passed that 10 minute mark. Don't worry guys, uh, by this point, if you're still watching, I mean, Kudos to you. You are awesome, and I personally appreciate it, but uh, the YouTube algorithm likes it if videos are more than 10 minutes long, so by this point, I'm, I'm really just stretching it out. <laughs> you can stop watching, but if you've uh, watched all the way to the end there, I mean, massive props to you. 
Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an awesome day. Oh, buy my books. Again, forgot to say that. And uh, I will see you guys all next time.